the game is uh, different on man many aspects. Uh, the mandate we received at first on the team was to redefine the action adventure genre on the next generation of platforms. And that was back in January 2004, so we didn't have any idea of what would be the next gen platform. So, so we just went on and, and instead of designing stuff for a particular machine, we just decided to design stuff for, for an idea of what would be next generation. So that's why a lot of the game design elements are totally different. There's not a lot of those video game-ish elements that uh, to be found in, in the game. There is some rank up scene where you receive new uh, weapons and get new abilities, but it's really subtle. There's no points to be earned, but really what's really, really new is that you play all of this in the middle of a crowd. And the, the, the NPCs is something really, really important in our gameplay, in our, in our setting. So you're not alone, you know, hidden in the shadow, you're basically a blade in the crowd and you're hidden by being socially accepted. There's some collectible items that we put inside Assassin's Creed, there's a lot of flags to collect. There's the Templars, there's like 60 Templars hidden. Templars are the natural enemies of the Assassins, so they will attack you and you just have to find them and kill them all. And there's a lot of side quests that you don't have to, to do. You know, all the safe, all the safe citizens mission, for example, that will switch a bit how the NPCs react to you, or at least you'll have some NPCs for you instead of only against you. Each target has his own unique way of of dealing with the situation of an assassin trying to get him. Right. So there's some uh, targets who will be afraid of you. They'll try to get out of there and then you'll have a, a chase sequence. You'll try to go where there's a lot more soldiers to to protect him. You'll go for a guard tower that you can that can be found in, in some districts. And then there's other like a knight, for example, he won't run. He'll try to, to get to you and, and eventually, you know, eliminate you. In general in games you must do all the levels. And so you have your entire story and then they put different endings depending on how you play. Here you can have the entire story if you play through it all and do all the investigation and really get your heart into it. Or you can do the bare minimum and you'll only have a part of the story. So I guess there's, there's only one ending but there's a lot of chapters that you can miss if you're not doing it all. The game is shipping on 360 and PS3 this uh, November, I mean November before Thanksgiving. And I hope you uh, player will enjoy their experience. I hope they'll play more, more than once and see all the all the things that there is to do in Assassin's Creed.